Okay, uh, what's up YouTube? It's my second video. Uh, I know I got a haircut. But, uh, so, alright, uh, back on the Russian tortoises and I got a little couple of painted turtles I got. Uh, I'm going to show them also. But, uh, anyways, so I went to Petco the other day and I got some coconut soil and um, snake bedding. Asmin is actually number one in the world for snake bedding. I think... It's number one, Asmin too. It's really nice. Then I got some uh, turtle bone, Kelki treat bones for tur turtles and tortoises. Um, it also floats in the water, which is pretty cool if you have turtles like me. I got this calcium supplement. I really recommend this that found at Petco. And then I got this Repcal right here. I love it, and they love it. <laughs> and then I got my little folder, my doggy folder. And then I got all my papers in there with the rush tortoises that I just love dandelions. Just to let you guys know. Got some hand sanitizer. I, I, I take out their poop. So, you know, you wouldn't want to get any germs, right? But they are awesome. I got a little trash barrel. I got a little sprayer to keep them nice and moist in their food. Put them some water. I got some rocks and tot, um, rocks and, um, Slate in there that I'm gonna use later. Then I, I just got a last game ball. I don't know what. Extra plate, and I use plexiglass. It might be hard to see it. I don't know if you can. Right here. Yep. So I'll get onto my brush of tortoises in a second. First, I'm gonna show you my little baby painted turtles. I love them. Now, the cage, um, we're gonna build something for them because we just built something for them. We're building on to that cage too. We're gonna make it um, come out right here gonna be awesome we're actually gonna clean this room it's gonna be it's gonna be awesome guys anyways um so that little guy is rocky i caught him in the wild they i recommend painted turtles they are awesome easy i mean <laughs> they can get a little smelly but as long as you got a big filter nice filter it'll be awesome now i don't know if they're a girl or boy <laughs> look at them <laughs> that's the other one under there i think they're a girl and boy i'm not sure that's the calcium floating in the water. I have to get that out of there. Oh, actually, you guys might not be able to see it. Um, where is it? Oh, right there. That's my little baby. A dog, I know. <laughs> I had son That's Rocky. I also had another one named Sonny, but he died. Because those two little guys were eating all the food. <laughs> uh, I miss him, though. I got a necklace from him. Alright, here's my little waterfall. That's. I think it's really cool. Show sure happens to go down, 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 down. So, <laughs> That's awesome. Here's my little bunny, Thumpa. We're gonna get him a nice hutch. Hey, little baby. Um, I, I know he's a dwarf rabbit. Um, I, I don't know any of him. A Netherland dwarf that rabbit. That's what he is. Okay, let's go on to the Russian tortoise exhibit. Okay. Um, so you guys might have you guys didn't really get a good view last time. So here's some Asmin. Uh, it's it's good. I'm gonna switch it up. I'm gonna make this corner a little bit bigger. I got the temperature thing right there. Gets up to 80 degrees to around 85. And that's good though. Should be like the um the late 70s and the mid 80s. That's good. That's the basking light. Really heat light made for all reptiles. A lot of them. Um, here's my UVB light. I don't have it right now because it was kind of hard getting it to go like this. Pointing at the basking area. That's his little pool. He just loves to do his business in there. I don't put water in right now because I actually got to clean it out. Um, that's it, one, that's one of the food dishes. Got to have a couple food dishes. They love to eat in different places. I got some uh, uh, of the calcium bone, um, cuddle bone, normally known as. Uh, one second, a fake plant fell. Oh, I have little fake plants all along the, you know, food platform. So I got a food platform. Oh, I have decorative rocks actually too. I got some tortoise pellets. I don't really like that though. But uh, I got them anyways. You know, you never know. So that's some bricks. We're going to get some better brick. Uh, Aquarium Lover, he has really good brick, and that's what we want to get. So that's this right there. Right there. That's some really cool uh, pink rock we got for little Tasha. And I did name my other boy. His name is Dylan Crisco. They, I bet they love their names, and I love them too. That's a spotlight. It's also like a basking light, but. It is a light and it gives light all around the thing. Uh, what else do I got? Oh, I got some cool rocks along on the bricks. Then they got the tile to go up inside the basking area. Um, and I'll show you. Guys. And then I got a log right over here. 
Uh, they love to go in there. And you know what I noticed, actually, guys? Um, I got a boy and girl, Dylan and Tasha. Right? So, one day, the first day I got them, they looked right at each other inside each other's eyes. It was incredibly cute. So, and I noticed <laughs> they were communicating like this. And I watched a movie on the desert tortoises, and they were going like that, male and females, which is awesome. And I'm pretty sure they're liking each other because they're in the cave together. And another thing I noticed, um, if I do have babies, which I probably will in the meanwhile, while, and I'm so happy because that's what we want to do. And we're going to build the cage bigger, which is awesome because I got my bro dad and my brother as carpentries, guys. Sorry, I just got to throw away some poop, but, um, what was I saying? Uh, um, the bad thing is if they have babies and they have males, too, well, we want to keep on having babies, but we don't want the males to fight. So, we're going to try to figure out an option. Maybe, maybe sometimes we'll have all the females in one and all the males so they don't see the females so they won't fight. You know what I'm talking about? So, um, I'll probably have like a little gate just in case going into the um, next thing. Now, I do recommend if you do have one of these, dig in it. Dig in it. Because they're going to get big. Like, they get pretty, pretty big. Not like a sulcata tortoise. I wanted one, but they get a little too big. They they actually are great pet sulcatas. Anyways, let me get back to the tortoises. Huh? Okay. Let's get this off. Okay, hey guys. Oh, you little cuties. Um, okay. Um, here's my little Tasha. Oh, I can't really hold it. Ah, uh, it's hard, you know, man. <laughs> All right, there's <laughs> little Tasha. You can also tell that it's a girl because she's lighter in color. And right now, I'll tell you how the difference between a boy and girl. See this little tail? Yep. I see that little stub. That means it's a girl, but if it's long, like little Dylan over here, well, before I say this tail, look how dark he is right there, and he's littler, so you can kind of tell. Um, look at his tail all the way wrapped like that. Woohoo, that's a big tail, little Dylan. <laughs> um, so, yeah, that's the difference between a boy and girl. There might be other reasons, but that's what I found out. Uh... Okay, well, uh, that's really it. I will do another video, maybe actually tomorrow, or but I know I'm definitely going to build another thing because my birthday's coming up. And yeah, and then we're going to build something for the turtles, so hopefully I'll do a video before that. Yeah? But uh, thank you, and um, thank you for... Uh, well, I didn't really get any subscri subscribers, um, but thank you for watching my video today and the other day. And hopefully... Um, if you like my videos and you think I'm pretty cool, because I think you guys are cool, uh, we could be friends um, on YouTube. We could talk and we could we can do a bunch of stuff together. All right, I got a call coming in, so that's my Russian tortoise exhibit <laughs> two. All right, uh, see you guys. Bye.